highs in the 20s next week. Those without a home are preparing for a tough few months. Christina Laurie is live this morning outside the Beacon Day shelter on East Wash to tell us how volunteers are getting ready to help even more people. Good morning, Christina. Good morning, Danica and Leah. It's cold out here this morning, but imagine having to face this cold weather seven days a week, 24 hours a day, never having a place of your own to call home. Homelessness is a real concern here in Dane County. That's especially heightened during the winter months. The Homeless Services Consortium says they counted more than 600 people experiencing homelessness here in Dane County during their point in time count from last winter. That's up about 5% from the year before. Of those, 84 people were found sleeping outside instead of a shelter. Volunteers and leaders from the Beacon Homeless Shelter in Madison say when it gets as cold as we've seen this week, it's dangerous and can even be deadly. When it starts to dip below freezing and get to 16 degrees like it was this morning, now you start to worry about hypothermia and illness, and, and those are killers in the homeless community. The Beacon says they rely on donations of hats, gloves, coats, and boots to give homeless people the warmth they need to survive the winter. This is just the second winter that the Beacon has been operating. The organize, organization rather, says they've learned a lot last year and are ready to implement that this winter. For more on the Beacon, the services they offer, and how you can volunteer, visit our website, channel3000.com. Important services there. All right, Christine.